What's up guys, it's your boys the Wokey back out with some more scary paranormal content and today's video we're going to be taking a look at Slapped Ham's scary video or footage that will make you scream and of course on this channel all the above when it comes to screaming, scaring, pooping pants, possibly wetting ourselves, all the above. We're going to take a look at it. So make sure you guys grab a chair, grab some popcorn, as you and I on this channel are going to get ready to be scared on Scare with Zawoki with Slapped Ham's newest video. So let's take a look. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys are returning and have not subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe down below by hitting that red bar icon down at the bottom right. Turn on notifications by hitting the bell icon next to it. So when I do post videos like this one, you're going to get that little ring notification that Zabuki myself has posted that video. And you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, I say thank you guys so very much on this channel. I can't thank you guys enough. Keep doing what you guys are doing. Tell those friends. Tell your family. And again, thank you so much for doing all the above. We just hit 1 million views yesterday and it's all because of you guys so with that being said keep doing it hopefully we'll be able to see 1 million subscribers one day but we'll do that together in 2022 or beyond and let's get into the video so make sure you guys also go over to slap tam do the thing subscribe comment like and share give him the love that he deserves for putting this together for us as well and let's get into it this is freaking man this cold my eyes what the is this is that the tree? Whoa! Oh, oh sh the yeah. flip was that? Oh, we've seen that one. <sighs> How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some super scary clips that are starting to freak the internet out. Starting? So hit that subscribe button and get ready for more creepy content. Just like this. Let's do it. Slapped Ham. Here in what sounds like somebody walk around. A user on TikTok named Alex Calvo is haunted has recently taken to the platform to share what he believes is a haunting inside his home. In the first video, Alex explains that he's been hearing some strange noises, so he grabbed his phone to try and capture something on camera. Take a look. I'm out here in my living room again, which is right by where that chair moved uh, the other night, and uh, I don't know, there's just been like scary going on around that. What was that? Oh. <laughs> I feel like I've seen this before, but it's still creepy. What the I saw that. I saw that, bro. I saw that little head. Watching that again, slowed down and brightened up a little, you can see a shadowy face peer I around the see corner. You. <gasps> I think this is Alex the one that searches the area, but there's no one there. This is the one with his grandmother. They believe it is his grandmother. Eventually, he finds a set of keys laying on the carpet that were not there previously. I remember seeing that. Okay, uh, Leo, great grandpa, whatever. I got the key. Oh, I got the keys. Um, I'm gonna try to find whatever they unlock. I feel like that's what you want me to do. Um, stop scaring the shit out of me. Is it like a safe? I'm do this. Stop scaring the shit out of me. It's like a house key. Then in another video, Alex explains that he's certain he just saw his deceased grandmother after hearing some bizarre sounds. <sighs> I'm up here where all the different, like, scary activity has happened, and uh, I'm hearing what sounds like somebody walk around on the floorboards. As I'm up here, I can feel, like, the pressure of steps landing around me. Um, I don't really know what's going on. Then suddenly, this happens. The light I, I turned on? This is, I don't know. This is not what I signed up for when I got this house. Oh, <laughs> Looked like Nana was in the closet. Here's the figure all brightened up. Oh. It looks to be an older woman wearing a robe. It looks like she's standing there. Moments after this encounter, Ugh. Alex finds a white dress or robe on the floor where the figure was spotted. Oh, oh hell was, no. Was there somebody in here or was that actually my grandmother? Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh. What the f Oh my god. Love the shower. The robe is sitting there on the floor. Are you kidding me? Oh. Not to be weird, okay? But I would smell it because sometimes I noticed that when my grandfather passed, you could smell cigars. Like the, the same ones that he, Paul Mall, cigarettes and 
and uh, cigars that he would smell or smoke, and you could smell them occasionally. I'm just wondering if he re would remember his grandmother's. Everybody's got to smell, okay? I'm not trying to be weird, but it, it happens. And maybe if he smelled the robe, maybe he could smell his grandmother. Sometimes they do leave those kind of impressions of scent or smell. It's a pot. I know if there's going to be somebody in the comments going, you smell your grandmother? No. It's just a thing that you know. It's just like a remembrance thing. Like there's certain things that I've smelled before, like hot dogs. It reminds me of 4th of July. And it's, it's a thing, okay? Just... Alex says that he believes this to be the ghost of his deceased grandmother. However, a lot of viewers thought it might be a demonic presence posing as Alex's grandmother Wearing to trick a robe. him. Alex says he's going to get in touch with a medium to talk about the situation. So let's hope all goes well for Alex and pray that his safety isn't at risk. Yes. It doesn't seem demonic. It just seems like it's trying to, oh. it's trying to show that its presence is there. And I'm not being sponsored by any way, but guys, but if you guys have a chance to try this drink, it's funny because we're watching Ghost, and this is called Ghost. This is recently new to my area, and this drink is fantastic, okay? It makes you so focused. Like, I'm, I'm like, legit telling you. Like, I've never had an energy drink besides this one, and Nas, great drinks, okay? You want an energy drink that gives you natural uh, stuff with... Uh, Epic focus, zero sugar, non artificial fl flavors and colors. Great drink, okay. A Reddit user named Photograph Firm took to the website to share a picture that seems to show something uh, eerie excuse me. in their house. What? Providing a bit of context, ah! the OP states that when they were leaving the house one day for work, they took a quick glance up at the window on the second floor. I've seen this before. Something legitimately disturbing that shouldn't have been there. But it's very disturbing. What would you do if you saw this? The photo appears to show a man's face peering out the window. It looks distorted. The uploader has said they live alone and insisted the house was empty. They also said that the figure in question was not moving at all and was as still as a statue. Well, then he needs to get an exorcist. So if this story is them. indeed to be believed, then what could this figure be? Some commenters suggested that it might actually be a squatter, perhaps living could in the roof or a crawl space without the homeowner knowing. This could potentially be a very dangerous situation. Which is really creepy. Others, of course, thought it could be a spirit haunting the home, perhaps the ghost of someone who died in the house years prior. So is this a ghost, a squatter, or is there another explanation? Let me know your you. take on this in the comment section down below. Yes, please. You guys tell me what you guys think. Ghost, squatter, demon, whatever have you. Back in 2019, YouTuber Time to Play TV had heard rumors of an old graveyard in Georgia that's been dubbed the Shadow Cemetery. Shadow Numerous Cemetery. witnesses have said they've spotted shadow figures walking among the graves or lurking in the nearby woods. But when they take a closer look, there's no one around. Uh. Curious to see if these legends are true or nothing more than hearsay, Time to Play TV ventures out to the cemetery to have a look for themselves. Sure enough, it doesn't take him too long to find out there is something strange about this cemetery. At around the 2.50 minute mark, as the uploader explores the woods surrounding the graveyard, something can be seen in the distance. What is what? it? It can be hard to see at first, but if we slow it down right as the camera pans, there appears to be a shadow figure standing among the brush. Where? Ah. At the time, no one noticed it. I didn't notice. I didn't even, I'm not gonna lie. Didn't While see this it. sighting is brief, it's what happens later in the investigation that has left many viewers freaked out. As the team explores deeper onto the property, they spot something eerie. What did they spot? Hello? Look, guys, look. What is that? Is that the tree? Oh, oh here, yeah. The tree. That look weird. As you can see, there's a strange tall figure peering out from the bushes. It's dark and looks to be wearing a hood. When it moves, it almost looks like a mist. Is it the Crypt Keeper? Is that the tree? I can't really make oh, out what it is. Yeah. The YouTubers explore the area, but there's nothing there. Got my back. 
least they're not running towards it. Right back here. No, I saw. I thought it was a tree at first, but it freaking moved. That didn't look Hello? like no tree. Hello? The comment section of the video seems to be unanimously shocked by the sighting. It's definitely he interesting. The uploader's bravery as he actually chased after the figure rather than running like so many other paranormal investigators. That is true. <laughs> is that the tree? <laughs> it oh, looks it's... misty, yeah. see through y. So, what I, is I don't this know. mysterious figure that was seemingly following Time to Play TV around during his investigation? No one really knows for certain. But given the rumours that the cemetery is haunted by shadow figures, it certainly does make you wonder what's being captured on camera for all to see. I don't know what I'd do if I saw that, bro. That the tree? Oh, s***. Yeah. Tree. I wouldn't walk towards it, I can tell you that right now. <laughs> If you just take a quick look at the following photograph taken by Reddit user Emotional Park 1292, you'd probably think nothing of it. But a closer look seems to reveal something rather unsettling. This could be an effect if of Paradora. Oh, 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 you can clearly never mind. make out what appears to be a face in the doorway. There's a certain th word that is known is called Paradora. It's apparently where your mind believes things that are there that are not really there where your mind makes up these images. I thought this was it, but I really don't think this is it anymore because looking at it, it looks like some gremlin looking character that, I don't know, that looks creepy. Super As you can creepy. imagine, curious Reddit users asked the uploader a few questions. And one of the most frequently asked questions was if there was any activity in the house the photograph was taken in. This is what the uploader said. Yeah, lots. Uncle said he would occasionally hear child's laughter coming from the garage. Their three-year-old started having some night terrors and said a young boy would wake her up. I remember when I was there, doors and stuff would slam closed. Apparently, the people who moved out before them refused to go upstairs and lived entirely downstairs for a couple of months before they wow. left. Wow. Definitely quite the eerie story and one that would make you not want to live in the house even for a minute. It makes you wonder, is the entity captured in the photograph that of the mysterious child that would wake people up in the middle of the night? Kinda looks or like a- Or is there a simpler, less freaky explanation? Like what? I'd love to hear your take on this story and what you think that figure is in the photograph. Leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. How about Diablo? I don't care. Screw that, man. Dahulu Kala is a smaller paranormal investigation channel on YouTube based in Indonesia. They often explore abandoned locations hoping to catch evidence of the <sighs> paranormal. In a video published to their channel in October of 2021, the crew head out to Complex Mati, a haunted complex that's been abandoned for approximately 20 years. I'm sorry, but there's so many abandoned places, okay? There's, I'm hearing it every single time. This person went to this abandoned place. This person went to this abandoned place. That person went over here. That person went to this place. How many abandoned places are there on this? I, it's ridiculous. There's so many. Just bulldoze it down and be done with it. In the Caladeras area located <laughs> in crap. Jakarta. Just by taking one look at the place, it becomes clear that this complex has certainly seen better days. See, Despite just tear it down. Boating environment, nothing too mysterious seems to happen. That is until the end of the video when the camera inadvertently captures something strange. So we Watch. got a K2 meter spear box. Oh, I remember that. I, I remember the scene is now. While one of the men tries to contact a spirit with a device in his hands, as the camera turns, you can see a fleeting glimpse of some kind of shadowy figure. Some I don't know still. It may have just been one of the men's shadows cast by the torch lighting. However, if you slow it down, it definitely seems to move of its own accord. I can't really, I've watched it like three or four times before. So what is it then? Was there a homeless person hiding in the abandoned building, perhaps keeping an eye on the men? I'm not or quite sure. genuinely a ghost? Either way, this scary footage is unsettling whatever way you look at it. It is, yes it is. 
<laughs> You've seen this one. I was posted to Reddit by a user named the Clown. So not to keep pa or pausing, but I make sure that you guys can hear me and the video at, at certain times. But looking at this, you can see I did speak about this in another video that was just posted not too long ago. You can see that when it pushed when they push play, the timestamp doesn't move. So that leaves me to believe that this could be possibly faked. But you guys be the judge and tell me what you guys think down in the comments about this. So and, and features a piece of home surveillance footage. Take a look at what the camera caught. See, it still says 103037. Why is it not moving? A mysterious shadow like figure seems to appear out of nowhere. I'm saying it has this. a strange hunched posture as it turns around and vanishes as quickly as it appeared. I don't know. I say this one's fake because the timestamp is not moving. Sadly, the OP hasn't said much in regards to the footage and the context behind it, but he has spoken about the family member who supposedly gave them the footage in the first place, stating, I originally thought the camera was for in case somebody robbed her, but it's because she heard noises downstairs when she was upstairs. If the know. footage we're seeing is indeed real, then it definitely seems as though the woman is living with a potential shadow figure. I call BS on this one because the time the the move the video is not even actually moving. So is this really a ghostly entity caught on camera, not this or is one. it just somebody else's shadow that we couldn't see? Be sure to tell me your ideas in the comment section down below. It's just a fake. This one's faked. Sorry, I'm not trying to be mean on that one, but it's fake. A Reddit user named OK Adhesiveness 6788 explains that they work at a psychiatric hospital that is rumored to be haunted. The uploader shows a piece of CCTV camera footage that was recorded somewhere inside the hospital. It seems to show something strange. Take a look. Wow, this is freaking man, this called my eyes. Like, what the f is this? This is what happens when you're bored on overnights. As you can see, there's a gray shape moving about the room. It moves weird. Wow. The uploader elaborated oh. on the hospital, saying, Yesterday, a light and faucet was turning on and off. Today, a nurse had their chair pulled back. I've heard stories of charts flying and growling noises, all sorts of fun stuff. Sadly, the quality of the footage Looks plus really the weird. it's filmed on doesn't provide many answers. Some commenters thought it was nothing more than a piece of cobweb floating in front of the camera's lens. I mean, that could be a two uh, cobweb. That would make sense. It could be a possibility. Others, however, thought the grey shape moved far too strangely to just be a piece of spider's web. Mm. And given the employees' first-hand accounts of bizarre activity happening throughout the hospital, it does make you wonder what actually is going on. I'll throw this out to you, the viewers. Spider's web or something a little yes. more mysterious? Comment down below. I wonder what you guys think, because I, I can't really tell what that is. Before we take a look at some chilling baby monitor footage, remember to tickle that subscribe button there, then <laughs> smash that bell icon there and turn <laughs> on all channel notifications. That way you'll be in the loop every time we drop our scary videos. I don't want you to tickle my subscribe button. I want you to smack the hell out of my my subscribe button to the point where it subs you subscribe, you turn on notifications, you like, and you share all at the same time. So make sure you guys do so. This next piece of scary footage was captured by a baby monitor watching over a child oh, as leave they the sleep baby in alone. their room. Take a look at what happens. Leave the baby alone. Oh, leave the baby alone. Out of nowhere, the child's blanket appears to be pulled down by an unseen force. <sighs> A couple of seconds later, the father comes in to tuck the blanket back onto his child before the video comes to an end. Did he see this happen? 
I mean, be taking Short my kid out. being an off-color prank, the footage does appear to be genuine. It does. I don't think any normal parent would deliberately try and scare their child by yanking at their covers with a piece of string. So what could have possibly caused this to happen then? Was there genuinely some sort of paranormal entity lingering around in this young boy's room? It could. If so, what could have possibly happened had the father not come in just a few seconds later? Have you seen Ghostbusters? They like kids. So they want to possess their bodies. Poor little guy. So if you can't get enough of the old slapped ham, then don't worry, we've got you covered. <laughs> Check out that link on the top there for some more scary videos. Otherwise, there's a massive paranormal playlist there. It will keep you entertained for hours and hours. Hit that thumbs up button or leave us a comment down below. And that's it for me. I'll see you all next time. <laughs> so with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video of Slapped Ham. I definitely enjoyed it. Some new content that we haven't seen, some old, or stuff that we've seen already, but that's the cool thing about some of these channels is they do show the same things here and there, but some channels will show different aspects of the same thing, and some will show the same thing, but you just get, it's kind of a different perspective from different versions of the channels. So I understand that we've... There's going to be things that we've seen before, but then there's also things we have never seen. So, but definitely a great one from Slapped Ham. If you guys liked it, make sure you guys like the video. And of course, comment down below if you guys think these are real, fake, fact, fiction, whatever have you. And we'll see you guys in the next video. So keep it real, keep it safe. And as always, keep nerding on. We'll see you guys next time. Peace.